Good evening friends, welcome to my channel. Today let's discuss uh, Cardi B and her VAP, that is her wet ass pussy. It's more like a sewage plant. I can imagine the amount of diseases and infections which must be lurking in that little Bermuda Triangle. And the kind of lifestyle she had because she was this uh, accomplished stripper, slut, convicted felon, a criminal who used to drug her clients and um, rob them of their uh, belongings. Like whatever is there in the wallet is all gone. If they are wearing any jewelry, it's all gone off. Hats up karti thi. Now this woman is the brand, now that she's doing all that kind of a rap, which is full of uh, dirty dancing called twerking, like you know, shaking her ass, a big huge ass. Now I can see females in TikTok and Instagram and everywhere, they're doing only one thing, twerking. Uh, twerking as I like that is the favorite time pass of everybody these days, females. And fatter they are, the better. Jiggles better looks like. It's sad. And her songs contain nothing but uh, uh, heavily on on pon on pornography. A uh, total. It's not about it's not about sexuality. It is uh, absolutely about uh, I hardcore pornography. It is. She's only describing intercourse. Uh, she's describing anal, she's describing kinky fetishes, um, uh, oral sex. It's always about a pussy and it's always... About, I'm sorry I'm sounding very very vulgar at the moment. It is not me but if you just see Cardi B has got millions and millions of fans. And her song is number one everywhere. All in the... F and it has been called pop culture's biggest uh, sexual en empowerment... Uh, uh, theme campaign each and every website each and every magazine in the west is you know putting her in the pedestal it's because they want to she's so disgusting so she's such an ugly bitch right Ek hota hai ki... look she's such a uncouth uncultured illiterate whore this kind of a person is a musician of the year. This kind of people get Grammys. They even perform at Grammys, half naked, fully naked, completely showing everything what is there. And everything is plastic, filled with silicone. Nothing on her is real or natural. I am I'm also wondering if she's a transgender because I shouldn't be saying this, but there are 100% chances that she is a transgender. And all this story about she having a child and she being a pregnant is completely fake. You know in the movies how they how these people get pregnant. Now they, they use a moon bump. <laughs> and now she's like, um, so she's a face, brand face for Pepsi and uh, Reebok. Wow. So sluts and prostitutes and strippers are like role models now. Brand ambassadors making millions. Look at the fame. Trending top 21. Lying on the floor, slithering like a serpent. Showing everything. Your thighs. Those are ugly bodies. Sorry, but they are like horrible. Cardi B, I don't know. She has to be like, literally be locked up in some underground basement or something. In some far off in somewhere in some desert <laughs> otherwise this female will really degenerate the entire crowd she will ruin she will make it everybody rotten one apple makes the whole basket rotten one rotten fish or dead fish you know contaminates the entire fish tank so cardi b is like this and of course a good friend Nicki minaj and all those people company but this one takes the cake Imagine having a role model who's married to a guy who's a babe, you know, who is a baby daddy of five different women. Please don't get carried away with this woman. She, I won't even call her a woman. She's a tranny. And be careful of, of this tranny. She's an evil demon, Satan. 
be careful of her stop listening to her songs just stop looking at her face if if she's coming on the screen just change your channel that's all i wanted to tell and women being a whore is not empowering it's definitely not being empowered and bold or sexy it's it's cheap and vulgar and po and pornographic <laughs>